Well, hello there, and good afternoon. Thank you for joining me. I'm Frost PDP, and today we're playing Brigandine Grand Edition. This ought to be episode three of our series is New Almikia, and we are... Well, we're advancing. The enemy does not yet seem to think we're a threat. Uh, it's my squad, my, my mobile squad's turn. How far can my actual, the actual leader move? Let's see if I can't bait them a bit. Stupidly aggressive, by the way. I guess not stupidly, but it's definitely heavily. But maybe he'll decide to start coming in. No, no, you're still not going to, huh? We're getting closer. Even the road, by the way, does enable movement. Sure, that's fine. Is he gonna finally move? Nope, he's holding. Has a scorpion. It's gonna scorp scorp. Have a giant for Pete's sake. His name is Thunder. He's a giant. Merman's kind of stuck in the back. His name's Walton. I got nothing for that one. That's just silly. So the unicorns are healers, by the way. That's important. Now, is she gonna actually... No, they're just sitting there. Is the AI broken? Is that what I did to myself here? I could... Let me just think about this for a second. He's got his... Ne He's the next unit after this one. He's got his men pretty far away, only that Weaver's gonna get there in time. So if I blitzed in right now and started knocking this thing up, and knocking it up, knocking it up, I could, usually I like to blitz, well she's level 10, she's not too weak. She'd be hard to blitz. Not that I couldn't do it. I could land attack. Two hits on her right now would be like, Significant hit point loss, maybe? And then Melagon's turn, maybe... Nah, not, not close enough yet. I do like the idea of sort of forming an eastern wall, though. Or, well, I guess from this perspective, it's western. Now, angels are not melee fighters, really. But they're capable of it, to some extent. Can I actually hit them with anything? I guess not. Now he's gonna actually start advancing. He's like, oh no! I've just realized the enemy is coming! Okay. Nope. Moving the griffin first. Eh, maybe I could've. This is definitely the kind of game where it is risky to get into engagements. Harden, raise defense. Oh, we're gonna do that. Power odds 100%. Do it! Is 
there any sort of magic I can use? Heal and cleanse. Negative effects and healing. Not a big surprise there. He has no healers. That's worth noting. He's gonna come in. He's the only healer he's got, really. Oh, look! Slobber is gonna attack Poke. Bit him for 98. And you get an automatic counterattack, and you missed, of course. And their centaur, they do have a ranged guy, he's a problem. Ranged units don't get a counterattack. They used to have polygonal battles, but they got rid of that, I guess, in this one. Magic. Alright, let's see here. Scorpion, you're somewhat disposable. You realize that, right? Uh, I have an 84% chance of hitting. It would do some damage. Those numbers are really accurate. Critical, 93. Poison them, yes, good. He shot me back. 87 hit points of damage. It's fine with me. Uh, giant. First, I want to see what the merman can do. He can't reach yet. That's pathetic. He's got to go wide then. Sorry, he's, he's going to be in a lot of trouble. If I move my little magey here, maybe I shouldn't have done that. My magey's going to get blasted. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to bonk you. Heavy hand, bonk. He's gonna obviously hit harder than me. Status effects for the win. Unlikely any enemy is going to get there, but if they do, too bad. Let's go. Time to box. They're attacking my griffin like it's a motherfucker. Yeah. That was so stupid of them. Yeah, hit my weaver and please. He missed. You suck. Oh, they're trying to flank me from, like, way away? That was weird. They're not lucky. Remember, we have this on medium difficulty. It's not like I got it in cheat mode. These guys are freaking bastards. Magic. Hallow. Next action will hit and earn 150% experience. That's a way to power level. But I really want to keep Pokey alive. So, heal. One hundred eighty three. Good. And that gets her some experience so she can start working on leveling up. Magic. Divine Ray. Blast some bitches. Now you wanna blast something that's not holy. So Griffins are holy, that doesn't really help me. But Ultimite here is just a clay golem. And better yet, their boss. She's a lancer. She's she's gonna eat some damage here. Hummy hummy ha! 174. I'm gonna knock her out of this battle as quickly as I can. Killing our monsters would get me more experience, but I don't have a better army than her by that big a margin. Ugh. It's not good. Apologies for that, my headset went completely dead there. Harden or dumb? Harden. Uh, they seem to want that angel dead pretty badly. Pull these. I'm 
so sorry. I've been hitting Pokey the hardest, so I'm going to shield him up. Yeah, if my voice is intermittent, it's because there's a glitch. Sorry about that. Hector! He might be dumb enough to do exactly this. Good, hit the merman that I don't care that much about. 137. It's not even that much. <laughs> this might hurt a bit. He's level 5 fighter. 98. Walton leveled up. They're ganking him. No! Walton, how could they? It's alright, we'll save him. Maybe not. Okay, what do I want to do? How do I want to do this? Magic. Curse. Dwindle. Fury. I'm going to curse this punk. Ooh, she's at 58. I can maybe knock her out of the battle right now. Drop scratch. No! You missed! Yeah. You fool! Punch it, I mean. Doesn't hurt to punch it. It ain't gonna hurt you much. Magic. Do I have any injured units? Pokey is still beat up. I know the music can be repetitive, by the way. Hard and weave hop. I waited to harden my troops up until they. That was weird. I waited until later to buff my defenses up because. Yeah, go for it. Dizzy! Haha! -ha. Divine Ray. Blasted my scorpion. No! Anything but that. It's popped! No, my defense is breaking! Critical 140. Oh! It's like that, is it? I got you. You're gonna kill this thing, aren't you? 81. He's nearly toast. Heal him! Walton, run like a mofo! Magic. Flame. This bitch. Take the entire second division out of the battle. My defeat will not change the war's outcome. Yeah, I mean it will. And look, one of their men didn't escape, so now I can capture him if I win this battle. Thunders in danger as well. 
The enemy might just decide to morale break and run. But I'm gonna bolt. Sort of form up like a secondary line of defense here. My cavalry's on the wrong side of this battle, but... Giant's probably more valuable to me. Divine Ray again. Can I reach this thing? Nope. Ah, crap. I'm gonna move down here just in case. I gotta send this guy ahead. Shielded. He'll survive. Harden. I can't tell if he's hardened or not. <laughs> is now. Hector, your squad's gonna act. You're gonna attack before you leave, I'm sure, but... 123... 82, he's got a stronger unit. It's weird. Ah, crap. He's got my unicorn. What can I say? Sometimes you lose soldiers. Yes, please, block it with your own men. That's exactly what I want to see. Should have hardened the damn unicorn. Aw, oh, man. Alright, it's Melagon's turn. Alright, how do I want to move this? Heal Y pop or do I heal old well I think I heal Y pop. Can't afford to cast any more magic. You know what, Pixie? You're getting some burn. can't counter you. 30 hit points is 30 hit points, man. It matters. I'm gonna blast this sucker. Yeah, okay, you missed. And he hit me for 126. Of course he did. Can't curse again. Chop! 123. He did 47. See the difference? Critical 140. 101. If he's smart, he'll run, but he's not gonna. Um, eh, it's not the end of the world. It's the end of that unit, but it's not the end of the world. Okay, or you're gonna burn me. That works too. They're trying to gank my leader.
sorry that I'm filling you guys with the audio on this one, by the way. I do apologize for that. It's, uh, it's just the way it is. We're going to go a little over time for that. My third arm will hopefully finish him off. I hate to risk him, but... I also know I'm moving him closer to a healer. Please just kill the bastard. You suck. At least you're not dead yet. Magic, heal! This creature has 72 health left. Fix that. We're gonna finish this battle up just cause of that. Uh, as of the last time, I almost want to just bonk you. Wait for now, keep the area clear. <sighs> Can't, can Divine Ray, but there's no targets around. So he, it's worth bringing him up. Alright, this is going to maybe determine the battle here. Bitch left. 73, alright. I'm sorry, Your Majesty, I will not fail again. Yes, you will. Leveled up. Sweet. It's turn 8. My guy starts off. Melagant regenerates, by the way, just because, you know, he does. I can't blast anyone. But I can certainly attack, first of all. Magic, I'm out of mana with him. Ohm, ohm! Can't really move anywhere. So I want to kill this centaur just because it's level 2. And a level 1 centaur is easier to kill than a level 2 centaur. Plus that gets this guy a little experience. Attack, Night Sword, what the hell is Black Death? Pre-move only, ooh, better. Well that was badass. Tango down, 300 XP's. And now it's just to you, you can actually retreat. Don't risk yourself. Uh, punch the, oh, you know what, I don't want to even do that. Just move. Just wait. Pixie's even gonna step up to take a shot before anyone else does. He would be stupid not to run. Okay, good. Alright, and we won our first battle! Norgard's army is in retreat! Victory! Pokey is level 3 now. You get level up when you win, by the way. Well, not... You don't get a level up when you win just as a guarantee. You get bonus experience at the end of a battle. And we captured All Might. Awesome. Very awesome. Oh look, Brusom quests. I guess we gotta finish this before we can save, huh? Oh wait, no we don't. We can hit a button and save. It's so awesome. But we're gonna actually do a legit save here, just in case something goes wrong. Brusom finds the hidden cave. His torch cannot pierce its darkness. Cautiously he enters. The cave is deep and it seems others have been here before. In the darkness, something brushes his hand, and Bruce extends the torch to find out what it was. A Hydra! It seems to be lost and scared! After some coaxing, the lonely Hydra is happy to join Bruce. Alright, cool, I got a free monster. And it's a Hydra, which is a pretty powerful monster. Bruce has returned to duty. Organized phase again, alright. So here's where we save the game and take a break. Um. So you've seen a bit of organizing, you've seen a bit of battle. By this point, you know what? It's on you guys. 
I want to hear from you. Let me know what you think of this series. Let me know what you think of this game. Hit the like, subscribe buttons, give me a comment, and thank you for joining me. And as always, La Paz.